Why does, he, why does everybody keep telling me to be safe? No, I'm never safe. Because these horsemen ride with the sound side, with heads like thunder, the rock will go by. We have no mercy to be far and wide. Bye, everybody. Hold on, let me put my sunglasses on. Yeah. Look. What's up, Whiskey Chaser fam? Welcome back to another video. I am in Gatlinburg, Tennessee. We are headed away from everybody. Had some good times with the fam. So Parker and I decided last night to do something a little stupid. So today is Wednesday, the 11th of, what is this, May? <laughs> today is Wednesday, the 11th of May. And the Coyote Ugly in Nashville is reopening after a year and a half, after a bombing that happened in downtown Nashville. And we're only 200 miles away. So I said to her, I was like, you know, what we could do is go. <laughs> and so, so we're going, headed out to Nashville to party for one night with the Coyotes. What's great too is Parker went ahead and called the Director of Operations and let her know. So we're on the list for tonight. Yep, but she's the only person who knows. Nobody else knows. Eats a How are they gonna know? How are they gonna know? All right, so we're headed out. Going to Nashville. Going to Nashville. Nice little quick 200 miles. We'll see you there. Scraping heels. Yep. Turn left on the Dolly Parton Parkway. Don't gotta tell me twice. What do we got here? Biker boys. Oh, we got a little wave from, from the missus. Let's go ahead and explain a little bit on what we got going on here because <laughs> it's kind of stupid saw that the opening was happening in nashville kate who works with parker at the new york location is there and lil the ceo who has actually been on the channel very quickly but has been on the channel before for the new york city reopening uh, is there and uh, a bunch of people who are part of the corporation and I came up to Parker yesterday and I was like look we could leave on Wednesday afternoon ride out for a couple hours out east find a motel park it get up on Thursday ride home I would be home on Thursday night but you don't have to work on Friday I was supposed to open the bar on Friday but the bartender who was closing messaged me and asked me if I wouldn't mind switching with her so that she would open and I would close. And I said, yeah, sure, whatever, I got you. Give me a little bit of time to, you know, unwind and stuff anyway. So I don't have to be at work until six o'clock on Friday. So I was like, if you want, if you want, we could make the 230 mile trip on Wednesday to Nashville, be there in the early evening, late afternoon, and then be there for the opening. We'll leave on Thursday, do a whole day ride, because it's supposed to be really nice like it is today. In the 70s, even when it gets down past the dark, when the sun goes down, it's still gonna be about 65. So it'll be a great day for a long ride. We try to do as much as we can, get as far as we can, 
park it, get up on Friday morning, head home. We can get home, look at all those bikes. Four bikes. It's crazy. Got an Indian, two Harley Davidsons, and a BMW. <laughs> so cool. And she said, yep, let's do it. So we're on our way to Nashville. We're about 170 miles outside of, uh, just on the west side of Knoxville. <laughs> it's gonna be a party, man. I'm excited about it. Nobody knows we're coming except for Chantal. Kate doesn't even know that we're coming. I think it'll be a fun surprise. It'll be a fun thing to do. Parker's never been to Nashville before. I've only been through it twice, stopped once. I was actually just outside of Nashville in Franklin with see Shade Tree Surgeon and Mike Branch Rides. But we got there at one o'clock in the morning and I left at eight the next day. Ready to roll, baby. Ready to roll. Exciting. I also forgot to mention that the bike is running amazing now for some reason when i left this morning we were going out through those twisties up in the mountain it still was giving me a lot of shit now for some reason uh we stopped and i started it up and it's fine I'm getting no bogging issues i'm getting no cutouts i have full power all through the rpm range i think i might have just gotten a little bit of maybe bad gas or something or maybe a little water got in through the intake and just had some trouble getting out. I'm not quite sure, but after that oil change, the surprise oil change in the 7-Eleven parking lot, it was uh, really, really difficult to ride. And uh, ooh, this wind, wow! But now it's running great. I don't know what happened. I don't know what it did, but good old Yamahas. <laughs> Just goes to show you the engineering that goes into these bikes. Literally ride through the middle of a rainstorm, your oil could be saturated with water. It looks like freaking Yoohoo. <laughs> All you gotta do is just get that shit out, put some new shit in, run it, it'll probably fix itself. <laughs> Hell yeah, Yamaha. Hell yeah. I love this bike. There it is, baby. Nashville. We here. All right, well. We're gonna head to the hotel, probably shower. Definitely need that. And then uh, get ready, head downtown. See you on Broadway. Nash Vegas cab, I love it. All right, here we are. According to that cab, we're in Nash Vegas, baby. So I wanted to, before we went out uh, downtown, I definitely wanted to ride down Broadway and I wanted to take Parker down. It's nice. Just cause I wanted you to see it especially from the street. Yeah. Look how many freaking people there are. Yeah, it's a lot. What's today? Thursday? Wednesday. 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 It's freaking Wednesday. There's so many people out here. <laughs> that place right on the corner right there, that's where mm -hmm. I stopped and had the ribs whenever I was here oh, last yeah. year. A bunch of these are all owned by, like there's Dirk's Bentley's bar, and then right over there is the country group, Florida Georgia line. I think they're right over there. They have their bar. Cool. Miranda Lambert's bar is right down over there. It actually just opened recently. Yeah, Natalie works there. Yeah. When I was here, it wasn't open, but they were still building it and I got to see like inside of it and stuff because the windows were. Last night we went to, what's his face? Uh, Blake Shelton's bar, Old Red, out in Gatlinburg. Is this Mrs. Yeah. And he also has a bar here. That's Alan Jackson's bar, AJ's. Cool. I know, it's cool, right? Lucky Bastard Saloon, I've seen pictures of that. There's a Margaritaville. That's Parker's favorite. Oh yeah. <laughs> Love me some Margaritaville. Losers. Bitty Boots. I love it. I love it. I think Luke's is Luke's Brian bar. Luke Brian's bar. Oh, there's an old red too. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> I love that it's like not too far from Miranda Lambert's bar. I know, man. The irony is not lost on me. Turn the left or okay. I was trying to turn around this thing. If we can. Nope, we can't. That's okay. Yeah, it's not a lot, but it's pretty cool, right? So now you can say you've driven down Broadway. That's really awesome. And if your bike was named Leroy, then it would have been riding up and down Broadway, am I old horse Leroy? Wow. <laughs> All right, let's find a parking spot. 
Get off these old horses. These old iron horses. And get some beer. Now you got that song stuck in my head. Get some beer and some whiskey. Whiskey! Whiskey! <laughs> That's right, baby. I'm so excited. I know. I'm excited too. I'm glad we did this. I'm not looking forward to the ride tomorrow, but I'm glad we did this. But I appreciate you hanging out with me. Y'all have a great rest of your night. We'll see you later. Hey, you want some boots? Sure. We got boots. Yeah. Boots. Good, baby. Good. Hey, you did. Alright, got some food at Miranda Lairbert's Casa Rosa Cantina. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Dude, we got a tequila shot and she poured us like... Quadruple. It had to be like at least three ounces. It was ridiculous. I didn't want to do it. Yeah, but we did it anyway. Tomasillo sauce on point, by the way. Good job, Miranda Lambert. You know, I know you watch these videos, so... Um, <laughs> headed over to Coyote Ugly right now. We have no idea that we're coming except for one person who put us on the list. One of our other buddies from Austin, Chris, who doesn't even work for the company, he's just friends with Tommy, uh, also came. So we just found out that he's here as well. And it's gonna be fun. I think it's gonna be, it's gonna good time. be awesome. Let's go. Pretty sure I showed this last time, but look at this freaking Taco Bell. This is a Taco Bell. A live music video. Dude, it's like a party over here. Coyote is me. Six and a half hours later. Oh boy. Starting out a little rough this morning. All right, getting on 40 East, headed back to New York City. What a good time we had in Nashville, Tennessee. Cannot believe we drove 230 miles in the wrong direction to party for one night. <laughs> But that's the kind of shit we do. And so begins the long and arduous trek home. Oh man. Anybody need a pool? So here we are at exit 407. Once again, uh, right by the Stony Mountain Nightworks. <laughs> I think I've been past that exit in the last three months, four times that I've taken the exit to go to work. <laughs> Shit. I know. That's, that's bad. Hope everyone's okay. You think that thing rolled? Yeah, so, a couple yeah. times. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. there's the van. God. 
Oh my god. Jeez. I think it's shattered. Yeah, right. Exit 69. Nice. Should be coming up on the state border right now. Yep, there we go. Welcome to Virginia. See you later, Tennessee. We will be back. We will be back. For sure. Alright, everybody. That's going to be it for us this week. Thank you so much for joining me on these past couple of videos out to Tennessee, Gatlinburg, Nashville. Had so much fun with my family, with Parker the Coyote. Just getting out away from the city and taking a big long trip on motorcycles. It's always so much fun. This is the last one I'm going to do for a little while. We do have July going to Ohio for the Camp Out of the Quarry. And that will be the next big ride. But don't go anywhere because I also got some fun stuff coming up in the next couple of weeks. Thank you all for joining me. My name is Chase and this is the Whiskey Chaser channel. And if you enjoyed this content, please consider subscribing if you are already a subscriber. I love you so much. Thank you very, very much for watching. Please leave me a like and a comment down below. Check out the links in the description. I have links to my Patreon. I have links to my stores where you can buy merch. You can get stickers. You can support the channel. Anything like that. Every little bit helps. I have a code for Fast Mask if you like the gloves that I was wearing. If you like the jacket that I was wearing. If you like the vest that I was wearing. Uh, that also goes back to the channel. So please just go check that kind of stuff out. And I'll see you here next week. Later, y'all.